On the occasion of this year's commemoration, I wish to pay tribute to the victims of the historic tragedy which unfolded 106 years ago now. Circumstances prevent me from being physically in Armenia for this event, but I can assure you that the Armenian people are in my thoughts today. It's an honor for me to share this message with you. When three years ago, in March 2018, I visited the memorial to the victims of the Armenian genocide, I could feel the intense emotional pain this monument stirs. I also recall feeling deeply moved by some of the pictures on display at the Memorial Museum. The experience made a lasting impression on me. The Luxembourg government is bowing to the terrible grief suffered by the Armenian people. We must not and we will not forget the hundreds of thousands of lives that were lost. They remind us of the atrocities humans are capable of in their darkest moments. They remind us of the need to do what is in our power to prevent history from repeating itself. Unfortunately, 106 years after the outbreak of the gruesome events, we commemorate today the threat of mass murder and genocide continues to plague humanity. The mechanisms of dishumanization are still not at work. Let me take this opportunity to express my solidarity with the Armenian people in view of the many instances of mistreatment they experienced uh, through their history. The recent war in Nagorno-Karabakh has brought new hardships to many families and shaken the Armenian society as a whole. At this moment, when Armenian citizens unite in the consciousness of their common painful history, it is my hope that your nation will find the strength to come together and build its own future, a future of peace, of democracy and of prosperity. I send you my very best wishes from Luxembourg.